hello guys welcome back to misodero's channel guys today we are in the house yeah, guys so here is my brother-in-law and here is my sister so guys today we're gonna talk about how we how they met and how their love life has been so they will tell us guys what has been happening what they share blah 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 you know and if you've never subscribed my channel guys kindly click click the red button up up i don't know if it is up or down but it's red so subscribe subscribe uh again if you've never watched uh their engagement video i'm gonna leave it on the description <laughs> box so welcome back guys let's hear from them so can you say hi to our viewers please hi viewers i am miss odero's sister and you are introduce yourself <laughs> you have to introduce them. no we were supposed to introduce <laughs> individually no uh, you introduce us uh, so this is the guy guys <laughs> so guys love is in the air so if you've never loved somebody first commandment from the bible is to love so that's exactly what they did so now without wasting much time let me um, i have some few questions for them so they are going i'm gonna ask them and uh, they will be able to give us um answers so number one how did you guys meet <laughs> how was it I think you should be the one to answer this since I have introduced us. Yeah. So now we're going to <laughs> Are you flashing on the camera? <laughs> he is. He is shy. Are you shy? He's shy. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, our meeting. I would say that it was... How should I put it? <coughs> Just put it the way you can put it. Yeah, with any words, just say it. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who guys met. Oh, man. Um, she can answer that. Okay, guys, we met at work where we were working. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, things happen. Uh, things happen. Yeah. Things, um, the rest is history. Yeah, the rest is the rest is, is history. And, so, we're, you know, and we're still making history. Yeah, we're still making history. That's so good. Yeah. That's so good. Yeah. So how long have you been together? For six and a half years. Oh, that's so long. <laughs> that's so long. <laughs> it's still brewing. Ah, it's still brewing. Brewing. Yeah, it, brewing. it is. Ah. It's brewing, but the 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 much we've known each other, yeah, I think that's that's the the. the the duration so the way they're looking yeah. at each other <laughs> yeah it's so bad mary <laughs> so now let's continue with the uh, question two mm -hmm. who are crossed who first ha, thank god you asked this question <laughs> i think we'll have to eliminate some questions hmm. why 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 will we do that <laughs> um because i did it first hell oh. no i did it first <laughs> That is why you don't want to, you don't want this question. Is it the reason why you don't want to talk? Oh, that's all. Oh, is it that? That's the reason why you don't. We want us to eliminate some questions. I was that courageous to approach him. So how did it go? How did you approach him? How I approach him? Yes, you tell us. Let's know. You did it first. So how did you do it? She came around and say, "Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel." And you subscribe. So that's that so nice. It. So that's so nice. Anyway, so she said, "Welcome to my YouTube channel," and he subscribed immediately. Uh -huh, and I so... did uh, press the notification bell. Oh, <laughs> so, so you know, anytime I sent new videos, he was the first one to receive them. Wow, yeah. that's so nice. <laughs> okay, my third question is: uh, Who did you pro? How, how, <clears throat> how did you propose to her? That's question. Now directed to you. Yeah. Okay, so how did um, you propose to her? It's been a long time coming rather, so it wasn't hard, but at the same time 
convincing her to be at the venue mm -hmm. without knowing what we were planning with my friends was a little bit tricky. Mm. But at last, and even knowing the ring size, I think that was the, the trickiest part. Because <laughs> you can't, you can't just go about buying any kind of. Gift. Actually, that's the that that was the fourth, she had fourth, to know. fourth question. So right? she was expecting it, yeah. and that kind of got a little bit tricky. Mm. So ask the fourth question. So, so that the, the, the mix it yes, up. the fourth question is: uh, How did you know her ring size? Check my neck, guys. I stole her ring. <laughs> oh my god! I stole her old ring. Mm -hmm. It's uh, pure silver. So I had to find a way to get it off her fingers. I I used it to go figure out what to buy. Guys, if you're planning to propose to your girl, you know how it goes. Now at yeah. least somebody has given you an eh, idea <laughs> on how to get a girl's ring size. Though it wasn't robbery with violence, it okay. was uh, robbery with romance. Ah, that's so nice. <laughs> I found what I wanted. So, the day we went there with our friends, Mm -hmm. We found what you wanted. And guys, yeah. Wow. You are gold. You <laughs> are gold. Yeah. Guys, don't wait for my sister. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. Please. Please, please, please. Okay, let's go to question number five. How did you <clears throat> how did you come to know that she was the right one? Due to I think you love also have to answer. How did you know? Let, let it start with so how did you know that she yeah. was the right one for you? Uh, she was most of the time when we were together she was easy to be with okay like that kind of uh, her presence just used to give me like I don't know how I can describe it but see the way she's smiling <laughs> yeah. uh, th there's just that feeling that is hard to describe like we can't put it in words okay so it grows by itself and you come to realize like okay it's different from anything that has been around you so yeah mm -hmm. so what about you how did i know that he's the one mm -hmm. man man i think the the aura that surrounds him the presence that surrounds him it's so it makes you feel so comfortable. It makes you feel like you've known him your entire life. It makes you feel safe. And I think that is the most important thing, to feel safe with someone. And so I think that presence around him is what just drove me so close. Wow. Mm -hmm. Guys, <laughs> if you want to know something, please, you have to try. At least know why you are being driven towards the person. Mm. So now uh, another question is: Do you guys have differences? Lots of differences, because of course we are not siblings. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Even siblings have differences. So of course we have uh, differences, but the differences between us, we know how to tackle them. Mm -hmm. We know how to handle each other's uh, uh, whatever. So it's easy to cope as long as you, you have learned how to deal with the, your partner. Mm -hmm. I think it's easy to, to cope with, with them and, and to just balance the differences between the two of you. Wow. So, yeah, we do That's have so differences. Nice. Yeah. That's plus, so nice. plus it's about kind of, um, how can I put it? Um, what she just said, you, you have to realize that this person was raised differently. Yeah. And you come in to complement mm -hmm. and supplement. Mm -hmm. So these two words, if you put them together, you will realize like, this is not my sister. Okay, we ain't sisters or brothers. So this is somebody who's been raised in a certain way. Mm -hmm. And you are raised in a certain way. Yeah, sure. And we're coming together to like, you got to sacrifice something and leave it out mm -hmm. and bring the best of you. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, whatever is remaining like if it is at least 80 percent you bring from home yep. and she'll bring the 80. the rest of uh the percentage that's remaining is up to you, the two of you to work it out mm -hmm. i hope guys you are watching men 
this guy is here to present you guys so make sure you subscribe to my channels kindly subscribe because we still have more videos about them and uh guys this video i've been thinking for more than one year just to make them sit down here and uh, interview them on no how seven. their love life no is seven. so guys uh, let's go to the next question so my next question is uh <clears throat> what do you not like about each other what do we don't like about yes, each other? Yes, yes. Maybe what he does that you don't like and what she does that you don't like. Hmm. Maybe an angorota ga usiku no penny. The dislikes, I think what we've done, mm -hmm. or personal, I'm not just personally, but I think for the both of us, what we've done is uh, that is where now the differences come from the question that you had asked earlier. <laughs> so, Mabi. so <clears throat> you are telling us something. Yeah, I was saying now that is where the, the question of differences comes. I'm done to spoil yeah. Okay, so uh, my next question is uh, what do you share in common? Hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you guys share in common? Love. I love it. For example, you can give us like three, three examples. Of oh, what we share in common. Mm -hmm. um, I think uh, family virtues. Mm -hmm. okay. We can't separate them. Whatever brings family together is all that we share. Okay. Apart from love, because you know how love alone can support you. agreement mm -hmm. i think communication is uh, very important mm -hmm. plus don't pile things when you have disagreements don't pile them because the moment you continue piling them it creates hate mm -hmm. 
Yeah. Because you'll be reminding your partner of, oh, Monday you did this, on Sunday you did again, on Wednesday, today we are on a Thursday. You always repeat it. So, uh, just speak about it, talk about it, Jenny. Just, just say it. Whichever way it will come out, that is where the differences come, and that is how we embrace our differences. So just say it. Just speak your mind. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So because as much as uh, you 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 have a disagreement, we always have the weighing machine in the relationship. You can't have. You can't be so. You can't stay with someone who is too negative, who too negative, and 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 the positive is down here. Mm -hmm. Apple, Apple, you, you guys are heading nowhere. Mm -hmm. But if the positivity is here, or it's nine out of ten you can always deal with the one that is remaining it's not so hard to deal with it so yeah are you gonna add something on top of it and advising people on relationship mm -hmm. um it's tricky mm -hmm. uh to advise people on how to run their relationship mm. uh do you yeah just just wake up and uh, find what works for you mm. actually for the for the both of you mm. if you find <clears throat> if you try to find what works for only you mm. it's going to be tricky That's true. and then also you 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 have to keep studying your partner if uh, you had a disagreement yesterday mm -hmm. you know you just have to make a vow that I'm going to try to make this maybe happen after the next coming year Mm. we're gonna disagree today but we don't have to like keep disagreeing mm. that's what she's talking about balancing between how much you want to keep the venom growing mm. and uh, how much you want to dispense it out and find the right place to dispense it mm. if you put it on your partner your anger your frustrations that is not the, 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 the right place to you know rather make your partner your best gossip mate yeah just talk about everything and anything mm -hmm. because you get to put a hundred percent and she will have to put a hundred percent if you put 50 percent whom are you reserving the other 54 that is when you start jumping out there mm -hmm. but if you give her a hundred percent she gives you a hundred percent uh the probability of uh finding a workable part mm -hmm. it's it's is it's very high mm -hmm. yeah but even even the pastor in the church will tell you just put 100 percent yeah most of the people will tell you i give 50 percent you give 50 percent then what about the other 50 percent and half 50 percent mm -hmm. that is where negativity will reside that is where everything else which is like not working will decide mm -hmm. so i'd rather just give a hundred percent so that she can deal with what i have and uh, she will have to give a hundred percent so that i can deal with what is coming and then we can start uh, like um, roughly in between and see what is not working and we try to pluck them out day by day mm -hmm. and, and it's it's a working progress you know it, relationship is just like um, respect mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you have to earn it and whatever you earn, you have to work for it. Mm. So before you earn, you have to work. So it's the same way for the relationship. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we, we've come a long way. We've seen people come and fall. And people will always tell you, Mutaachana mm. too. Mutaachana too. Guys, let us stop being negative. Yeah. Mm. If you see a good, a good relationship, pray for them to go. Mm. So yeah, I won't, I won't be in a good position to advise anybody. Mm. But I would rather advise myself as they listen no. so that they can try. And remember, mm -hmm. relationship is like a, a football match. Yeah. When you're outside, you see these people better than they can see themselves. Yes, that's true. That's so true. it's up to you they in your own relationship mm. you have to be your own spectator jump to the podium and look at your relationship from mm -hmm. at least a distance so that you can see what your partner has been telling you is not good about yourself mm -hmm. and she can also stand from a certain distance and tell you uh, i'm seeing this from this point mm -hmm. yeah thank you <laughs> that's so nice guys so guys as you have heard from the love birds themselves so today is the happiest day of my life since um 
this is the first interview in my channel uh, about love and we still have more coming up guys so watch kindly watch my next video it will still be about them the juicy questions <laughs> about the couples and gonna answer that i know some will be closing their eyes some will be like oh no we cannot answer that but they, i'll make them to answer the, all the questions that i have set for them so guys thank you so much uh think, what are you going to tell uh, what can you tell our viewers before we wind up subscribe to miss odero's channel that's all subscribe 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 mm -hmm. actually just don't subscribe watch like, like share uh, press the notification bell wow and subscribe wow thank you so much you'll find guys. us there you'll find the kids there wow. you'll find the whole community there we yeah. are all there mm, wow so sweet guys so <laughs> guys subscribe okay and if you've not watched the engagement video kindly go to the description box i'm gonna leave the link below bye bye until next time bye <laughs> it's my brother-in-law and here is my sister so guys today we're gonna talk about how we how they met and how their love life has been so they will tell us guys what has been happening what they share blah 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 you know and if you've never subscribed my channel guys kindly click click the red button up up I don't know if it is up or down, but it's red. So subscribe, subscribe. Uh, again, if you've never watched uh, their engagement video, I'm going to leave it on the <laughs> description box. So welcome back, guys. Let's hear from them. So can you say hi to our viewers, please? Hi, viewers. I am Miss Odero's sister. And you are introduce yourself. <laughs> you have to introduce me. No, we were supposed to introduce <laughs> individually. No, uh, you introduce us. Uh, so this is the guy, guys. <laughs> so guys, love is in the air. So if you've never loved somebody, first commandment from the Bible is to love. So that's exactly what they did mm -hmm. so now without wasting much time let me um, i have some few questions for them so they are going i'm gonna ask them and uh, they will be able to give us um answers so number one how did you guys meet <laughs> how was it i think you should be the one to answer this since i have introduced us yeah so now we're going to Are you flashing on the camera? <laughs> he is, he is shy. Are you shy? shy. Oh, oh God. God. Mm -hmm. Okay, um... Our meeting. I would say that it was... How should I put it? <coughs> mm -hmm. Just put it the way 